We've been lucky enough to be part of the Iowa DNR's Waste Sort. We have a crew of people that have been traveling around the state and they're sorting through the trash to figure out what kinds of materials are coming in as trash to be buried. Good. The benefits of that for the community are then we can actually share that information and say we have this much plastic or this much paper or this much materials that could be put someplace else rather than put into the landfill and creating awareness will help to create behavior change. The waste characterization studies is really the biggest piece of data that we get in. You know, certainly we know, you know, the tonnages that each of the landfills receive every year. We know that, but we don't know what it is that they're receiving. So this will allow us to break it down. You can see all the different containers and the staff that is needed to sort through the garbage. And the garbage is, is coming from the working face. We take a random section of that pre-identified load and physically sort through it into the 80 plus categories. Having it broken down into those more refined categories allows us to be a little bit more knowledgeable with what's in there. The waste that we do get, we're sorting, and in this instance, everything does go back to the landfill. Nothing can be separated during this waste sort to be recycled or recovered. The data that's going to be used uh, can be put towards education and outreach, drop off locations if they're needed, and just spark some inspiration of how these materials can be recycled. There's a lot of opportunity for growth with this data that will be coming out. There's no other way to get the data other than to roll up your sleeves and do it. And that takes uh, a lot of commitment and dedication and hard work because we're digging through garbage. It's not necessarily the funnest thing to do, but the data is really important and it's the only way to get it.